Hello, in this short video, I will show you how to create Facebook ads with the objective of sending traffic to your site using Ads Manager. So the first thing you will need to do is to have Business Manager account. If you don't have one, just go to business.facebook.com and follow the prompts. Once you're in there and you have your ad account set up, click into it. Click the green button that says create ad. Our objective for this video will be sending traffic. Name your campaign something meaningful so you can find it later. And click continue. Now in the ad set, we'll select where do we want to send our traffic to. It can be website or manager or app. Now we can define our target market for this ad. You can either use saved audiences, which you can create beforehand using audiences in the assets tab, or we can create a new audience right now. So if you want to create new audience, we can use custom audiences, let's say a traffic to the site or email list, or we can use lookalike audience of our custom audiences. Now we can specify the location. It can be either country, state, city, or radius around a specific location. Define the age for your target audience. Define gender or leave it as all, and you can change languages if you want to target people speaking different languages. Now we are ready to go into detail targeting and include people based on their demographics, interests, or behaviors. So let's say for this one, we want to target people with interest in entrepreneurship, whose job titles match CEO, founder, or owner, and owners and CEO. We can also narrow our audience down if we feel like our potential reach is too high. Now we can do narrow. So let's say we want to target people who make at least 50,000 a year. So we would select their income. And we can continue going. We can also narrow it further down if you want to get really, really specific. So let's say we want to target people who are also interested in social media marketing. Now, when we like the size of our audience, we can continue going at connection types or exclude people. Now we are ready to specify the placements for our ads. We can leave it as automatic and let Facebook decide where is the best placement for our ad, or we can edit placements and select devices or platforms we want to advertise on. Audience Network is a list of mobile apps and websites that work together with Facebook to show your ads. We can also go into advanced options and select specific mobile devices and operating systems or exclude categories for audience network and instant article placements or apply block list for audience network. Now we are ready to specify our budget and schedule. You can decide between daily budget and lifetime budget and you can run ad continuously until you go in and manually turn it off or set a start and an end date. If you decide to go with lifetime budget, and specify that this campaign will spend no more than $500. You can also specify a start and an end date and time. Finally, you can optimize for ad delivery based on link clicks, impressions, or daily unique reach, which will show your ad only once a day, which may be good if you have smaller audiences and ensure that you're not bombarding people with the same ad. You can also 
specified bid amount to be automatic or manual and you can tell Facebook how much each click costs to you. You can also decide when you will get charged based on link clicks or impressions. You can also schedule ads to run at specific days and time. So let's say you want to show your ads between 6 a.m. and 12 p.m. each day. Or maybe you want to show your ads only on Tuesdays and Fridays. So you can play with blocks and see what works best for you. Finally, you can specify delivery type to be standard, which will show your ad throughout the day. Or go with accelerated, which will show your ads as quickly as possible, meaning that you will run through your budget pretty quickly. Once you're happy with your ad set, you can name it something meaningful and click continue into ads. Now in the ad, you can select our format to be either carousel, single image, single video, slideshow or canvas. Then we can select images, but the way I prefer to do it is to select website URL first. So for this one, let's just use the homepage of my site, the socialmediacurrent.com. Now this will pull in some images and text it can find on the site and clearly we'll need to change that. So let's specify images first. Um, if you like the image, you can leave it or you can upload more images, browse your library or find a lot of free stock images that you can use. Select the image you like. And you're happy with the image, click done. And you will see this image already pre-populated here. Now let's go into headline and text. Change the text to whatever you want it to be. You can also change a call to action button. Finally, you can change the display link and make sure that you're tracking all your conversions using Facebook Pixel. Now, once you're ready with your ad, ad set and campaign and you're ready to go, click the green button that says place order. Facebook will review your ad. It usually takes 15 minutes or so, and you will get an email notification as soon as your ad is approved and ready to run.